Yeah, yeah, I know. Pokemon Sun and Moon came out today. Ooh, it's so important. I know. We'll get to that. But this is way more important at the moment. Before we begin, and so that I don't face a lawsuit, I'm legally required to tell you all that this video is brought to you and sponsored by Naruto Online. Naruto Online is an MMORPG produced by Namco Bandai Games and CyberConnect2, where you choose from one of five classes and join Naruto and his friends on a journey to become the strongest ninja in the entire ninja land I actually haven't seen that much Naruto truthfully so I'm a bit rusty but I know a little bit and I know that this game is pretty fun so that should be about 30 seconds for my FTC so let's hop in and become the strongest Naruto ah hell yeah dude let's see what we're working with here all right we got Midnight Blue, the Lightning Man, Azure Fang, the cute blue-haired chick, I like her, Scarlet Blaze, the hothead of the bunch, Breeze Dancer, the last airbender, and Crimson Fist, the muscle wizard. Now, again, I, I love me some blue-haired cuties, I really do, but I'm really feeling my boy Crimson Fist right now. I think uh, that's the face of a real winner. That's the face of determination, and I can respect that. We're going with Crimson Fist. Oh, wow. I'm not gonna lie, there's actually hella people playing this. I'm kind of surprised by that, to be completely honest. Alright, Naruto, let's crush this interview and get into Ninja High School together, my friend! Uh-oh, looks like this eight-year-old kid wants to fight me in Naruto for some reason. I guess we don't really have much of a choice. Yo, where the hell did all of these people come from? Ah, oh, dude, check it out! By completing this mission, we get five whole Narutos! Nice! Okay, listen here, you dumbass kid. If you want to throw hands, then let's throw hands. I'm gonna... Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh no. We just fucking faded that kid. I'm... I'm not entirely sure how legal that was. Oh, I feel bad now. Well, the blood's already on our hands. I guess we're gonna have to take out both of his friends, too. Nobody said that being a Naruto was an easy job. Mission complete, Mr. Ninja Guy. We beat the shit out of some kids. Good job. Welcome to my school. Well, thank you, Mr. Ninja Man. I appreciate the opportunity. So, from the looks of it, you can get a bunch of different party members from the actual show in this game, apparently. So, that's pretty cool. I oh, shit, my boy Rock Lee's in this? Yo, Rock Lee, he, he was always the best character in this show, bar none, by the way, so... Shout out to him. Ooh, we get five Sasuke's from doing this mission. Absolutely sign me up. Oh no, he's getting all of the girls instead of us. You know what that means, right? We gotta beat the shit out of him. I'm sorry, that's just kind of how things go here, Sasuke. Oh, I'm sorry, do you want some too? Do you seriously think I'm not above hitting a bitch? Well, here, let me just, uh, let me just set the record real straight. That right there, folks, is why you never challenge me. I am the strongest Naruto. I go in, I have no mercy. All right, we've got our team fully assembled. What's next, Mr. Ninja? Go kill some wolves. Okay, good job. You are all very strong Narutos. Thank you, Mr. Ninja. I will say, I, I love the fact that if you just click on a certain mission, the game just auto pass that shit for you. It's, it's great. It's like I get to play the game without actually playing the game. That's what I've always wanted. Man, I'm not gonna lie, I I think I'm a low-key god at this game. My team has been sweeping everything super hard. I have not even come close to losing any battle. I, tell me I won't become a full-time professional Naruto online player. Tell me I won't. I'm not exactly sure what this strengthening stuff does, but it makes my numbers go up, so I'm doing it. Oh shit, it's my boy Kakashi Sensei! He's also one of my favorite Narutos from this world, so sh shout out to him as well. Yo! I actually remember this part of the show really well. This is the thing with the two bells, and whoever doesn't get one of the bells doesn't get to eat lunch or something. It gets, like, tied to a post or something like that, so... I oh. Um, okay, maybe I don't really remember this as well as I thought. I forgot all about the part where two Naruto's had to make an army of clones to fight another Naruto who made an army of Naruto clones to fight us. I, I, maybe that's a manga-only thing or something? I don't know. Wait, hang on, I just realized... Why do I have this chick in my party? I mean, do I uh, do I even want to use her? I'm very confused. I, I I don't know, man. If it ain't broken, don't fix it. Oh, I actually remember this part of the show a lot too. We gotta escort this bridge guy to the town so that he can build the bridge or something. But 
uh, things things get pretty hairy pretty quickly. All right, I guess we're doing that arc now. Cool. Hey, so uh, oh, what the actual fuck is this demonic Illuminati eye thing doing laying on the ground? You are entering a fight with high difficulty. Continue challenging. Reminder: if this fight is lost, revival potions can't be used to revive. Is this a bad idea? This might be a bad idea, but you know what? Nobody became the strongest Naruto by only making good decisions. Oh shit, it's a tiger! Oh, I immediately regret this decision! How are we gonna kill this guy? Dead. Easy. All right, bridge guy, come on, we're getting closer to the village. I <gasps> oh no, assassins! They killed Kakashi Sensei! You monsters! I will never forgive you for this one! I am so mad right now! Ooh, never mind that though. We got some loot boxes or something to open first. Let's see what we get. Uh, uh, so far, it's looking like a whole lot of nothing. Just some rando items that I'll probably never even touch. Well, that was underwhelming. I Oh, I have a small treasure, too. Okay, let's see if this is any better. Yo! All right, bitch, get the fuck out of my party right this second. We got the god comp now. Hell yeah. All right, Lee, let's see what you can do. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That's it. I'm, I'm never losing a fight in my entire life. This team right here is unstoppable. Oh no, it's the super powerful Miss Ninja guy! And Kakashi's alive again, by the way, he didn't actually die. There's no way we'll ever be able to take him down! And he died in legit 17 seconds. This is the easiest game. I am the best player. You know, I'm really not that sure how much I agree with Earth beating water, but, uh... I mean, you do you, Naruto. You do you. Well, now that he's dead and totally never ever coming back for sure, we can move into the real big boy mode of this game, take on the ultimate trial, and officially become the strongest Naruto's on the face of the planet. And this will give me some time to talk about how I feel about this game as a whole. I gotta start off by reiterating, no, I am not the biggest Naruto fan on the face of the earth. Hell, I might even go as far to say that I actually don't even really like it that much. With that being said, though, Though, I do like this game. It has a very large, colorful, populated world to explore, and lots of enemies to fight. The combat system in this game is actually really, really fun. There's tons of different party combinations to mix and match to see what works well, what doesn't work well, what works in certain situations. The options are practically limitless. Trust me, if I really didn't think that this wasn't a good game, then I wouldn't be sponsoring it. That ain't me. Getting to play a fun game though, and being paid an exorbitant amount of cash for doing so, that right there is right up my alley. If you're a big fan of Naruto, you'll enjoy this game. If you're a fan of tactical MMOs, then you will enjoy this game. There's a little something here for everyone. If this does look interesting, and if I've done a good job convincing you, then make sure to go check it out. And also remember, this game is totally 100% free, so you got nothing to lose. All right, shilling aside, it's time for us to continue our ninja training by beating up some innocent woodland creatures who are just minding their own business. I'm sorry, eagles, tigers, and wolves, if I don't punch you with my rock fist, how am I going to become the strongest Naruto, dude? You have to understand. Yo, hang on, did somebody just send me a friend request? For real? What is this, Nami? Uh, hello? All right, I guess we'll have to wait and see if she responds. Good job, everybody. Mission complete. Well done, well done. Couldn't have done it without working together as a team. What is that? Oh, hey, there's Nami, too. What's up, friend? Uh-oh. The evil Mist Man is back, and he's gonna wreak havoc on the village unless we stop him. Who could have seen this coming? Oh, no! It's not just Mist Man, it's also Masked Man! Two of the strongest Naruto's out there! We're gonna have to use all of our Naruto power to take these foes down! It's over, Mist Man! You're no match for my ultimate powers! Get ready for the ultimate hit! <gasps> the lover took the punch and saved him! But he died! That's so sad! Damn. I guess being the strongest Naruto 
comes with a price. Well, that's about where I dropped this show, so I guess that's gonna do it for this video. Actually, that's not true. I think I watched until the end of the tournament arc, which was pretty dope, but I digress. Again, a big shout out to this game for sponsoring me. I've got some big plans come January, and I'm definitely going to put this money to good use. Make sure to check out this game if you want to have some fun, because it's very fun and interesting. And that's gonna do it. Play us out, Grandpa watching the sea.